Alright guys, well, I got her fully assembled, finally. All the soldering's done on the board, I just have to wait for the flight controller. The motors, the ESCs, props installed. I got the old shell on there for now. This thing's a monster. From prop edge to prop edge is 40 inches, exactly. And these are 13 inch props I have on here carbon fiber. Should fly fairly nicely. Now I'm one-handed as usual so bear with me. Always drop those. Alright so still got some little tidying up to do but uh, she's all done. All the flight control wires or the ESC wires anyway. Now when I installed the battery wires, I've got one main wire. And I left it long because I'm not sure where it's going to go or how it's going to fit. And I also attached two JST plugs. And it's all hooked up to the same power source these ones. My video equipment I'll run on a separate battery because we don't want any interference. Alright, I'll put you down for a second and I'll fold it up a bit. So there's the ESCs all mounted underneath and nothing's permanent yet because I may have to adjust these wires for the motor rotation. But uh, it's good enough to get it up in the air to start. Uh, these legs came with the frame and I did my signature yellow bone 69 legs which are uh, a product of Home Depot products and they actually look a little more scale compared to uh, that little shit that was on there before. And there it is, all folded up. And like I said, from prop point to prop point there, it's 40 inches. That's awesome. <laughs> um, with my legs on there, from point to point, is actually just under 13. So actually, it makes it a bit tougher for getting the pelican case I wanted. I might have to go one size bigger, but that's okay. It's a monster! So, just waiting on the flight controller now. And, uh, we'll put it in the air. And we're gonna try to put it in the air with the FlySky remote. I've been watching a lot of videos on how to program that. And just because there's only one three-position switch, maybe we just won't use flight mode manual. Go without one. But I do want home lock and uh, intelligent orientation control, attitude, GPS. So we, I think we can make it work. Anyways, uh, if you guys have any questions or there's something you want to see that I didn't show, by all means ask and I'll put it up. Other than that, we're just waiting on the mailman. Alright guys, thanks for watching. <laughs>